Yeah, it was a tough loss. Obviously, we played against uh, one of the best teams actually that played here so far. Uh, congratulations to Toronto on the, on the performance. We also, I would also want to um, thank to to our players. I think after three games uh, uh, this week, uh, that was you, you cannot ask more. Uh, from our guys, they did a huge effort, they did their best, and as I said, we played against a very good team. So we, we have to look uh, uh, forward and um, after uh, to come back next week uh, with the best possible um, uh, recover, recovered and the best possible mindset in order to understand that we have now three more games at home, important games in the next stretch, and that these, these games are targ uh, we target as a must-win games, obviously, like we did so far, always. So we will we'll recover, we will bounce back, it doesn't worry me, but uh, it's obvious that we, we are looking for, for the reaction now, and we will, we will react. Right here, Russell. Coach, with the injuries on the back line, where do we stand on some of the players and coming back like Brandon Vincent? Brandon is close to his uh, recovery. Uh, this week he will uh, start normal training with the group, so we'll look how it goes and how uh, we can help him. His fitness, obviously, and sharpness with the ball so he can be available for the next game against Minnesota. Um, but there, there are no excuses. Uh, I think the team understands that uh, the perform. This is, this is like a marathon, you know, things like this happen and you just have to be, just have to stay positive and you actually have to know that, that every team in the league has these kind of moments and they are coming, they're, they come and they, 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 they go. So you just have to believe, keep working and keep the mood. I think the guys, as I said, I think we have a very good locker room, uh, champions inside and guys who are uh, not happy with a, with, with a loss, but uh, they also know that we will, we will bounce back and we will, we will back to the performance that we had um, in one point this season and we will build another momentum. And when you look at the season ahead of, of us, the games that we have, actually the best possible moment to happen is, it's never a good moment obviously, but we still have time and if we are capable of bouncing back and building the momentum in the next um, two months, it's going to be probably uh, enough for us to go to, uh, to play playoffs, but it's also very important to finish the season hot, and that's, that's going to help for the playoffs too. Dan? Uh, I don't know you talked about how good Toronto is and they lead the league. How do you think you stacked up against them today? Can you say that again, please? How do you think you, you held up against Toronto? I know you said they're a good team and they lead the league. Yeah, I think in the first, we didn't have a good first half. We kind of um, were too much timid and um, or actually we were teaming, and um, we struggled to understand um, how, actually we struggled to quickly switch from when we don't have the ball, what we are doing, uh, which we want to press in, in a middle zone and press uh, their, their midfielders and cover the, the ball uh, to Altidore and to, to Jovinko, um, and then switch quickly to, to the transition and, and possession of the ball and control of the game. We struggled in that second half, I think it was better. Good reaction, uh, quick goal, and we conceded the second goal, which killed us practically. And, but still the team, I, as I said, uh, did a great effort. The team uh, uh, tried hard until the end. Even after the third goal, Arturo was close to score the, uh, the goal, so that could have helped. You know, we always played until the end. You, and when you still have time, you play until you have it, and then you, you give your best. That's our identity, that's what we do always, that's what we ask, and the guys did well on that. So I think overall, um, we didn't play uh, the way we are used to, uh, but as I said, we, we are very, we're, we're a good team, and we are committed to turn this back and, and bring the team where it was uh, just a month ago. Oh, no, you had a record crowd tonight and playing the, the team with the best record in the league. Is this like a playoff atmosphere for you guys? Yeah, it was a great um, rehearsal you know, for, for us. Playing against one of the best teams that we can face in playoffs, playing also in front of our crowd and uh, full house, 
uh, was very important and we were very grateful to our fans as you, as you could see at the end of the game. We gave, we gave our best, the guys went to say thanks to, to the crowd because they were amazing also today and very, we are very grateful for, for their support and coming here. So we will always look to give our best and give our, uh, our people, our supporters the best possible soccer and we will always look uh, towards improvement.